in the injectors and start them up before they sit on it. You don't sit on a Nitro Harley when it starts because it's too dangerous. Somebody please explain to me how this thing gets safer once it's running. So the top fuel Harley final round. Ty Tharp, number six qualifier. Now, I mean, we're, we're talking about the Spevco guy. We're talking about a former champ. We're talking about a guy who knows what he's doing. Randall Anders just ran rough shot over these guys last year and won the championship. Look at him, front end still in the air, down past the 600 foot mark to the stripe, 624, 224 miles an hour. Randall Anders wins it. Ty Tharp goes 628 at 224 miles an hour and doesn't. What are you kidding me? Number one qualifier was 629. They both outran that. 624 to 628. We're going to have to get another look at that one. We've got the small screen up here on top of the right-hand grandstand. I believe we lost signal down there to our maiden Sunoco vision, but check this out. Watch the front end. Up, up, up. You'll know when they touch down because it smokes the tire like an airplane landing. Yeah, I don't want no part of that part of the ride. Both of them, 224 miles an hour, 624 beats 628. Randall Andrus takes another Top Fuel Harley trophy back to Louisiana. Oh, man. That is going to be a Top Fuel Harley highlight for a long time. 